Now, the reason for our popularity is that the alternative out there is the relational database. And you have to remind everyone that this was originally conceived over 50 years ago when the world was a very different place. The first constraint is that the relational model is incredibly rigid. It's designed for a world that was very uniform and very predictable. Well, we know that's not the case today. It's also very brittle. It's hard to make changes when your business needs to respond to new opportunities or new threats. And it's awfully challenging to scale. So the MongoDB founders were, became tired of investing more and more mo time and money and effort to work around these constraints. So they said, this gotta be a better way. And that epiphany was what we call the document model. The document model built on JSON, as we believe, we would argue, is the easiest way to organize and work with data. It allows you to model and represent the messiness, the high interdependence, the constantly evolving nature of data of the modern world. It has the flexibility to handle a wide range of data types, uh, which is so important when, you know, 70% of the world's data is unstructured. It offers agility to easily make changes as your data model and your business to your data model as your business changes. And it also enables you to do that when the pace of change is only ac accelerating. And because MongoDB is built on distributed architecture, it offers unparalleled scalability and performance. And we think that the ch pace of change is high today. It's only going to get faster with AI. The next wave of AI applications are all about agents. And instead of single purpose chatbots or autocomplete on steroids, agents are most similar to the way humans actually think. We focus on an outcome, then, then we decide what are the process and steps and tasks we need to take to get there. And agents operate the same way. So they won't just make us more productive, they'll actually drive true business and industry transformation. 8.0 set a new bar. So of course, we couldn't wait to raise it again. That's why today we're announcing MongoDB 8.2. As we enter an agentic world, performance isn't just about pleasing human users. It's about machines talking to machines, applications calling agents, agents calling other agents, all in real time. Not only do agents not take lunch, they never sleep. It's an unforgiving workload where every millisecond Every throughput gain matters more than ever. MongoDB 8.2 takes another big step forward in performance to meet the challenges of this new era. In 8.2, unindexed queries are up to 42% faster, which means even when requests are unpredictable, responses will stay quick and reliable. Array traversals, the kinds of queries that dig into more complex data structures, are about 20% faster, making operations smoother end-to-end. -end. And time series bulk inserts run nearly three times faster, so you can ingest massive streams of machine-generated data without hitting a wall. Most database vendors only protect data at rest or in transit over the network. But when data is in use and being processed, it's often left exposed to administrators and service operators. Unique to MongoDB, queryable encryption closes that loop. It's the first fully integrated database technology that keeps data encrypted, not just when it's at rest and in transit, but also, and here's where the big difference is, while it's actually in use in memory. With queryable encryption, MongoDB ensures your data can only be viewed by the authorized application while still remaining searchable with expressive query types. But with 8.2, we've expanded what queryable encryption can do. We started with the support for exact match equality queries and express expressive range queries across numbers and dates. Now in 8.2, we've added substring support, letting you search encrypted data with prefix, suffix, and partial matches. Bleeding edge builders don't have the time to wait. So starting with 8.2, every incremental release will now be available across Atlas, Community, and Enterprise Advanced. This gives you the freedom to put new and advanced capabilities to work the moment they're ready. 
And for those applications that are sensitive to change and need to stay on a release longer, we've got your back here too. Currently, major releases are supported for three years. Starting with MongoDB 8.0, I'm very excited to announce that we're extending long-term support from th three to five years. It'll give you more stability when you need it and the freedom to innovate on your own schedules. Now, if you choose to run in Atlas, you can run on AWS, Azure, or Google Cloud. Atlas has more than 120 supported regions worldwide across all three major hyperscalers. You can keep data close to your customers, meet governance requirements, and integrate with native cloud services wherever you operate. But Atlas can do a lot more than just run on different clouds. Atlas supports a single cluster spanning across multiple clouds. So you can leverage each provider's unique features and specialized infrastructure from a single deployment. This is especially important today when it comes to the fast evolving AI landscape. This flexibility ensures you can always take advantage of new AI capabilities regardless of what cloud they're available in. So, whether you're managing MongoDB yourself or relying on Atlas as a fully managed service, you stay in control. Free to deploy, move, and scale in the way that best supports your growth today and in the future. AI helps us create applications capable of understanding the world as we humans do. And this will really bridge the gap between computers and people. What does that actually look like in practice? Let's start by taking a look at some different applications that leverage AI. First up is Retrieval Augmented Generation, or RAG for short. RAG finds the most relevant information in a knowledge source using vector-based retrieval. And that information is then fed to a large language model to generate accurate, grounded responses. Next up are recommendations. This is the ability for a system to intelligently surface content that a user would like to engage with. Last but not least, we have agent memory. These agents require memory to maintain context and adaptive feedback, much like humans do. Bringing any of these use cases to life depends on one critical component, and that is the quality of your embedding models and re-rankers. This is often the difference between potential and production. So if embedding models and re-rankers are so important, where can I get great ones? Well, I'm glad you asked. MongoDB Voyage offers best-in-class embedding models and re-rankers. We have your typical general-purpose text embedding models, which turn pure text into an embeddings. In this category, the Voyage 3.5 series outperforms competing models from the likes of OpenAI and Cohere, all while being more cost-efficient. We also have powerful multimodal models, where typical multimodal embedding models are only capable of vectorizing a single photo or a single text string, Voyage Multimodal 3 is capable of vectorizing interleaved text and images. And it can also capture key visual features from screenshots of PDFs, slides, tables, figures, you name it. And this eliminates the need for complex document parsing while still maintaining retrieval accuracy. Innovation is the name of the game when it comes to AI, and embedding models, quite frankly, are no different. We recently released Voyage Context 3, a breakthrough in precise chunk retrieval with global document context. This contextualized chunk model is the very first of its kind. Our model processes the entire document in a single pass and generates a distinct embedding for each chunk, delivering superior retrieval performance. On the re-ranker side, our recent re-rank 2.5 release sets an industry standard for re-ranking with instruction following capabilities. Search and vector search have been in Atlas for a while, but we understand that a lot of development starts locally. And as such, I'm pleased to announce that search and vector search are now available for community server and enterprise server. With these two releases, we're opening up our text and vector search capabilities for development, testing, and production in your own environments, in addition to Atlas. We all know many of you are surrounded by large estate of legacy applications, which were built decades ago. 
and they still run critical parts of your business. These applications stick around because even making the simplest of change is extremely risky. How many of you have heard this phrase? Don't touch it, it's mission critical. These apps are draining budgets, risking compliance failures, security breaches, and ultimately slowing you down, slowing innovation. Introducing MongoDB's Application Modernization Platform, or AMP for short. AMP helps companies rapidly transform their legacy applications into modern, scalable services on MongoDB. By combining AMP tooling with MongoDB's proven repeatable framework, customers have seen some of the tasks like you know, code transformations speed up by 10x and overall modernization efforts by two to three times faster. These modernized apps will land on MongoDB, so you are better prepared and positioned for the future.